Hello friends. It's such a beautiful day to get out. Just enjoying nature. It's into March now. It's 70 plus degrees. But spring ain't here yet. But guess what else is out? What else is out? Them carpenter bees. You'll start seeing them now. So this is just a reminder for you people that know nothing about these carpenter bees. Of course, if you've got a house out in the rural areas, you know what I'm talking about. It's that time of year to start putting your carpenter bee traps out. And you'll say, well, what's carpenter bee traps? Well, for the last couple of years now, I put video out of video out on these carpenter bee traps. How to make them, where to put them, how to put them, how to take them down, how to change them, how they work, and everything. You can see all the videos right here. Everything you need to know about them. Now these things will start eating up your home. You already know that most of you. So you new subscribers, you might check this out if you have carpenter bee problems. Now these little things, they look like bumblebees, but they're not bumblebees. They're carpenter bees. And they like to bore into wood, not to eat it, but to make nests in it for their young. And they do this year after year, and they'll destroy your wood siding, your wood frame, and everything around your house and home and property. And these are just little, little tips to help you. Now, it's that time of year to get them out. You can't wait till they're flying around in May and June to put them out. They've done established their nest. You've got to get them out before they get out. What I mean is, before they start making their nest, by May and April or June, they've done to establish their nest. You're wasting your time, basically. So you better be getting them out now. Now's the time to get them out. So they're looking for a home. They'll see that hole in them little traps, and they'll go right in. So this is just a reminder of what these little things can do. So if you're interested in any of these carpenter bee traps or how to control your problem, I'll leave a link in the description below the description of this video of how to make them, how to make the traps, how to hang them, how they work, and everything you need to know. So I want to thank you for watching. God bless, and I'll see you next time.